That's about it. I said, okay. So, he said, we went into, like I went into fighting with Dusty. And he said, I could lick Dusty because I was so big and so strong, you know. But he was fucking strong. He was crazy. He was crazy strong, like he said, with Dusty. And uh, so anyway, we got to know these guys. And he, uh, they got to know us a little bit. And the other night, he said to me, Do you, could you handle, still handle two or three guys, young guys like you did in those days? And I said, oh, no. What, do you, what could you handle? I said, well, I'm 72 years old now. I said, when you're 72, you'll realize what, what I'm doing, you know? It's going to be sound like bullshit to the ordinary man now. So anyway, that's how we put it off as. And, but he said every once in a while, he'd say the odd thing, but fuck, he said, I went into a lot of garbage through the dust. He said, I did more things helping him out than I ever did anybody in my life. But it's because I was so big. He come over, I'm seven foot fucking tall. He said, when I come over here, people, I'm seven foot tall. Anyway, it turned out near the end that his son, this guy's son, was, um, was, um, yeah, this guy's son was crazy, tra crazy, uh, crazy drinking. I, I'm going to say that right now. And anyway, I'll say, you're going to think, um, uh, David's. Like if I, I don't want to ever, ever hear anything said to David about, about me taking in, on to this, these people again because I've never ever told them that I have taken on to them again or anything like that, you know. And uh, so anyway, that night, about an hour, oh, I, oh here, yeah, here's a fucking, I got, now I got to remember this. We went to this restaurant over here. You remember it used to be the spice shop over there years ago? Spice well, shop. Yeah, it was, there was a, it was a big spice shop right over here at the corner of, um, right, right, right over here, and uh, like I could. Hey, how are you? Cause you every time you kids used to come over here, and you every one of you, one of you would always say, "This is good stuff, boy. It's smelling this." Is, and you know, I used to take his over, and I remember, I remember once I took his all three, and it was through the place, and it was good stuff, it's good smelling stuff, you know. And anyway. So anyway, you know, I'm not put, there's no fucking table up here now, is there? Yeah, it's over there. Though. Do you want this here? Well, I'll just put it back in the bag if you don't want it. Oh, okay. I don't That's mind. all you want to eat? Yeah, I'm just not into it. Mm. So anyway, well, I, 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 I honestly thought when it come down to it, they put me in a... At the, right, right here at the north, north so a, down, you know, at the bottom of the ramp, down... They, where I was, you know, the big ramp went out on outside the place. When I from out from when I, from upstairs, you know. Or at the barn? Yeah, right yeah. Right in the big barn. I know I'm not there right now. It's making me. I think I am. Anyway, he said. To, he said. I, I, he said I've been. I've been brought. I've been hired. Brought over here by you to run this place. I. What do you mean run this place? He said, I want you to, he said, they want me to get you to run this place, the whole fucking place, the whole system back. I what do you mean, horses and everything? Oh, no, no, he said, just a little bit of other stuff I'll mention later, but as it turned out, he never did. So anyway, we went over it, we got out of here, went over to the ramp, bottom of the ramp, and then he started telling me about meat and dust. He knew Jack Ack, Jack or Ack, Ack or blah, blah, blah. New Jack Ackwood went over there, and uh, he uh, said, by the way, I saw Jack just the other day. I said, he's, I was down in, uh, I was down as a, a guy to take over this place, and Dusty recommended you to come and help take over this place. I really, not. so anyway, we got talking a little bit more later, when we, cause we couldn't get alone, eh? Couldn't get alone at all, and we were talking about that me and Dusty were something to do with we were gonna run the top of this barn somehow but it was gonna be run as something else and uh, fuck I'm sorry you're gonna think I'm anyway we got up to the top of this ramp and I said you know I said, I've been up here a lot of times fighting before we used to come out to the top of the barn here before and come out here. yeah he said Dusty told me he used to fight up here a lot and I yeah we did but you know anyway we get up there at the top of the ramp and I'm talking to him about 
things I used to do around the ramp, but I'd throw in a guy right off the ramp, and well, he said, Dustin told me he did that, you know, and, and I said, yeah, well, I did too, and so anyway, we, uh, we get into more things like that than what went on like this, so anyway, he said, by the way, in about 15 minutes, I got to meet you right across in that building, the old, it used to be the old spice place, I said, okay, so, he said, let's get walking right now, we can walk. He said, I don't trust any place around this fucking place with what's going to be going on me lately. So we went above, above the street, we're walking really slowly all the way around the place and real slow right over towards where, where he was trusting people to talk around us, you know? Yeah. And uh, so anyway, we went over to this place and it's a restaurant inside this place. And uh, so I get up into this place, I said, he, he said, do you know your way in here? I said, well, not really, I said, but I... I do and I don't. I, I was in here a couple of times when I was checking and picking up spices and that for my for, for my brother Bob at the time, you know. And so, but we didn't really didn't know every little building and everything in the whole place, little, little, little room. So anyway, well, he's, this is where the boys met me. And I, what do you mean, what boys? Like Dusty? And, yeah, Dusty and Jack. And he said they met me, and then he said they met me. How's life? Okay. Who's that over there? Yeah. Anybody that talks in a kind of deep, harsh voice around you, I don't trust uh, you at no, all. No, 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 not after, not with that what I've run yeah, into lately, you know? Mm -hmm. The last couple of days. Fucking spies. I mean spies. It's, uh, and so anyway, he said, we'll go over there, because he's all I know is that they're having something for you over here. And I'm thinking and thinking with all the little things that have happened to me, I don't know what the fuck's going on with them. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what they're doing for me. And yeah. I come to the conclusion that I thought they, somebody killed you. I'm telling you this day. I thought somebody had either killed you, Gary, or Alan, you know, or Sharon. But no, I wasn't particularly pleased. I know that you had trouble every, you know, I've heard of these people always having trouble you, having trouble with your wife and everything. So anyway, I go into this place and every fucking person from in this, all, they're all, they're all with me. You know, they're gang they ganged up with me. And I couldn't wonder what the fuck they want me in here for. And finally I said, come on, let's, hey, we're just going in the main fucking door of this place right now. What are we in here for? Well, he said, I can't tell you because I don't know myself, but I'm going in here for things that are going on with me. I said, you, you're involved. And that's all I could say. And so anyway, I got, as soon as I walked into this place, it's it's great big, Restaurant bar, the restaurant bar is what it was, and this was uh, the other day, it was Sunday, 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 yeah, some Sunday, and, and uh, so anyway, we were up there, and Jesus Christ, we in there, and these fucking guys had meals for the order for us like you couldn't believe. And I'm talking food, boom, 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 like this, you know what I mean? The order up for us like that, and uh, finally, I, I said, "Come on, what's going on?" And I want to know what's something right now, and he said, "What?" This, this is still that big guy I'm talking to, you know. He said, I still believe that, that, um, well, I said, I still believe that somebody has killed some of my, one of my family or something right here now and then and now. And, well, he said, I can't tell you one way or the other because I don't know. But he said, we're going to have to do something here to see if I can get a little bit of information out of them guys. And I was always saying, hey, this guy's them guys. And, you know, I don't know who the fuck you're talking to. Tonight. And uh, so anyway... We walk in this. We walk into this big front of a building. It's got part of the Western Fairs in there, and there's, he said to me, "Do you ever you ever shoot a gun like this before?" And he, he puts his gun up, and I go, and he goes Drr, like this here, you know. He's this fucking thing will shoot faster than any weapon in the world. And I said, "Well, no, I haven't." But I said, "I'd sure love to just as a just as a thing to do, you know." And, yeah, he said, so would I. I said, I've never actually shot anything. I guess, fortunately, I've come close to it. Some of the fucking weapons I've shot around this place have been terrible. Sometimes I went right over there beside the railroad tracks and, and shot weapons that are almost as good as what you're talking about, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And, but anyway, we didn't. And, uh, and uh, so anyway, we went over there and all, and we sit down, me, me and this um, guy, sit down. I think his name was Carl. Some, some fucking name was Carl. And he said to me, he said, we're gonna, 
in a little while, I don't know when, there these guys are all gonna come in that big that big door there and meet you. They're all gonna come in. What the fuck are they coming in to meet me for? Well, I don't know yet. But anyway, all these like most of the guys that come in there, they look like fucking uh, sons sons of Mexicans, you know? They look like Mexican people. 